times, but something is lacking. The Lord cannot move. We are untying the hands of God. For what reason? We are not worshiping the Lord. We are not worshiping the best worship. We are not offering the best worship for God. We are not giving our best talents for the Lord. We are not giving best giving for God. We are always putting God on the, on the last part. But we are not putting God on the first part of our life, on the top of our priority. And even I tell you, the Lord wants to pour out so much blessing upon our lives. If we will only hear the voice of God. If we will only listen to the voice of our God. Kaya bago tayong magpatuloy. Magkano ibibigay ang para sa Diyos at narating natin para sa Diyos? Ilang kalulawa ang tatanin mo? Anong talento mo i-offer mo? Anong the best na gagawin? Tanungin mo sa akin mo. What will you offer for God? for this forthcoming anniversary. How many souls are you going to bring? Will you sacrifice your time? Hello. Ask yourself. Luke 6, 38 says Luke 6, 38 says Given shall be given a thing Good measure, press down and shake them together For with the measurement you use to God You will be measured With the, with the, the, the same measurement That you use to God Sa pagkatap sabi ng Luke 6, 38 says Magbigay ka kayo bibigyan. Gusto ng tangan sa iksik ni Tiko, makakawal lang sa katikanya niya. Maaaring masabi ni Nanay Cora Pabrega, hindi na ako nakapag-exhort ng opera. Opo. Pero patuloy ang kanyang paghayo at laging laman siya ng padalaging ko araw-araw. Huwag niya po mababayaan ang nanay na ito. Bigyan niya po ako ng kalakasan. Pero nanay, hindi po kayo bigo. Sabagat merong krisitigin po manin sa inyo para mag-exhort ng opening at magbigay din ang the same na pesa pagbibigay na ginagawa ninyo. May pinanay ko ang pabrika ang will say, I am not exhorting anyone in front of the congregation. But you are not a failure because you encourage the line of krisitigin. To do the same. And not only that. You are not alone in challenging people to give their best to God. God raised up with CTG and the likes to challenge people to give to the Lord. Nanay ko na, nga, lapit nga po kayo rito. Just a Christian DJ, lapit ka nga rito. I did this study pastoral course. I did this study bachelor, I did this study evangelist course. I did this study bachelor of theology. I entered and studied in different Bible training school. I know how to make sermons. But I must, I must obey God. I must obey the leading of the Holy Spirit. Father, 
this is my prayer. Keep these two sisters more strength and pray. Let them bring souls to Jesus more and more. Let them give more and more. Let them challenge and encourage people around the world to give more. Find the divine way. Find the miraculous ways by God. Make them like Mary of the New Testament. As Mary of Bethany poured out to Jesus her expensive perfume and, it, and become an encouragement to all the people of the world that will, that will read the Bible. Father, I pray that the lives of these two women be an encouragement more not only to the Philippine Islands, not only to the Filipino people, but to all the people around the world. Even I command all the strength, miraculous strength, extraordinary strength to be upon them, I pray. And even I pray, Father God, bless them abundantly. Let them eat the fruit of their labor. Let them experience the fruit of their labor. And Father, I pray, let them give more and let them challenge more, I pray. Father, for your own glory alone, you did it before and you can do it again. Touch them now, I pray! In Jesus' name, the Son of the living God. You
done like this people and left this term of the viewers, women of yours, my God, all many people around the world to give their life to Jesus. Lord, I just pray to God. Father, for your own to love me, I'm not doing this to get you mad and angry. 
But I'm doing this to put into practice what you have learned this day. And after this, we will continue with our message and we will ask something great for God. Come on. Sige, bigyan ng papel lahat. Nabigyan ba lahat ng mga papel? Wala namang kumikilos eh. Mga nandun, hindi namang kumikilos eh. Bagal ninyo eh. Hindi ka tumatayo tulit eh. Ganda-ganda ng kasuot namin. Hindi ka tumayo. Sister Nemo, tumayo ka kaya. Ati, ati, ati Tuan, hindi ka tumatayo. Bigyan mo ng papel yung mga tao. Hindi nyo ilalaglag yan ang inyong Tyson Operage. Hindi ko tayo kumukuha ng Tyson Operage po. Ang kinukuha, ang hinihingi po natin mga minaman ay eh, para sa anniversary. Bakit ko ito ginagawa? Kasi nung Sunday, wala naman nagbigay para sa anniversary. Ang mga nilaglag ninyo, mga Tyson, mga Operage. Hindi ko nyo ilaglagayin yun yung mga Tyson Operage ninyo. Kanina yun at saka mamaya bago matapos. Kukunin natin yun. Pero ngayon, hihiwanin natin yan para sa anniversary. O sige, bigyan po lahat yan. And even to those, uh, to our brethren abroad, to those who are watching and listening right now, right now, no? PM us or text us, contact us. What amount of money or how many, how much are you going to give for this anniversary? Nobody is exempted. Bigyan nyo sila isa-isa. Yung ayaw magsulat, namapas na kayo, kumi na kayo. Pero hindi kayo uwi, hindi kayo lalabas kasi magsusulat kayo. Sige, bigyan lahat, bigyan lahat. Bigyan lahat. Eh, bigyan lahat. Oh, sino kaya ang bibitaran ng si Kristo lang sa buhay ko? Bakit na ako? Si Kristo lang sa buhay ko, bita mo yung keyboard mo. Si Kristo lang sa buhay ko magpakailanman Siya'y pumasok sa puso at isipan oh, Ako ngayon ay masaya Pagkat ako ay binago niya Si Kristo lang sa buhay ko magpakailanman Noong araw ako katulad mong kuribot Kabig dito at kabig doon But when Jesus ay nakilala Ngayon ay todo na para kay Yesu Cristo Yes, Amen Before I was a kuripot like you A selfish like you. Greed for self like you. But when I met Jesus, I encountered Jesus in my heart. I am now giving my best to Jesus. Giving my best to God. Nobody's exempted. Nobody's exempted. Di ba parang pag-aaral yan? Marami nag-aaral, di naman pumapas ah. Maraming arga-aral, di naman nakaka-graduate. Ang mabuting guru, gusto niya makapasalat pa graduate lahat. Kaya ito rin dito. Eh, ito ba kaya na sa atin? Kung nakikinig lang kayo nakikinig, every Sunday, wala namang nakayari. Pag mo sabihin, wala akong ibibigay. Pero nung kang ibibigay, ayaw mo lang magbigay. Ako, sabi ko nga sa inyo, ako magbibigay ng pinakapalaki itong darating na anniversary nito. Shiloh, Hannah stood up 
Now Eli the priest was sitting on his chair by the doorpost of the Lord's house. In her deep anguish, Hannah prayed to the Lord, weeping bitterly. Verse 11. And she made a vow, saying, Lord Almighty, if you will only look on your servant's misery and remember me and not forget your servant, but give her a son. Specifically, now Hannah asked for a son, not for a daughter. Hannah prayed to God specifically. And he, she prayed to God, give me a son, not a daughter. Give me a son, not a daughter. This is the right prayer. This is right praying. If you will ask something to God, if you are praying to God, no, pray specifically. Kunyari, nananalangin ka ng kotse, sabihin mo yung tatak. Eh, this is not a joke. Sabihin mo yung kulay. Saan mo, mo hospital, gusto mo mga anak na wala kang utang, babayaran mo lahat. Anong klaseng pagkaana ang gusto mo? Sabihin mo sa Diyos. Amen. Pray a right prayer. Pray to God specifically. Tell to God what do you want. Hello? Are you still listening? Sabihin mo sa Panginoon. Lord, I want my son to become a pastor. Say it. He will turn around. Her, his life will turn around before the end of this year. Say it. And don't doubt. Hello. Pray to God specifically again. And she, let us uh, read, read again verse 9 and 10. Verse 9 and 10. Once they had finished eating and drinking in Shiloh, Hannah stood up. Now Eli the priest was sitting on his chair by the Lord's bus of the Lord's house. In her deep anguish, Hannah prayed to the Lord, weeping bitterly. Verse 11. And she made a vow, saying, Lord Almighty, if you will only look on your servant's misery and remember me, and not forget your servant, but keep me, or give her a son. Her, it means me, he, her, a son. Pakisabi, a son. Saan mo gustong mag-aaral? Ano ang kurso mong gustong matapos? Saan mo gustong makarating? Kaya sabi ko sa mga kapatiran, Sige, kampos yung lahat niya, tanongin lahat ng presyo niya. Pago mag-anay para sa akin, bibili natin lahat yan at bibili talaga natin yan. Ganito ang tamang pananalangin. What Hannah did is a right prayer, was a right prayer. He prayed to God specifically, give me a son. Not a daughter, but a son. Hello? Hello! Ganyan ang pananalangin. Ano gusto mong mangyari? Ano gusto mong maganap? Ganito ako manalangin. Pag ako lumuhod, pag ako nanalangin ng biyak, sinasabi ko sa Diyos, direktahan. As I pray, I kneel down to God and I tell to the Lord, what I want according to His will. Saan mo gustong tumira? Anong subdivision mo gustong tumira? Anong pagkain ang gusto mo? Anong kasutan ang gusto mo? Anong klaseng tao ang gusto mo mga mga asawa? Tell to your God what kind of person do you want to be with you forever? What kind of person you want to become your spouse, your wife or husband? Yes! Tell your person, specific, tell your God a specific, a, a specific prayer. Hello! And don't doubt, Hannah didn't doubt. And another thing, she made a vow to the Lord. 
Then I will give him to the Lord for all the days of his life and no razor will ever be used on his head. Then I will give him to the Lord for all the days of his life and no razor will ever be used on his head. Anong number ba ito? Anong number ba ito? Ha? Number three. Ilagay mo yung number four. He made a vow to God. He made the vow. Verse 11. Napaham mo? Oh, number four. Made the vow to God. Hey, nagbibigay mo na. Pero pag pinas mo, ayusin mo ha? Mamaya na mo na yan. Mamaya na yan. In verse 11 po tayo. In verse 11. Verse 11. Verse 11 po. Verse 11 po. Verse 11. Verse 11. Yan po. Mabait ako. And she made a vow saying, The Lord Almighty, if you will only look on your servants, Mr. and remember me and not forget your servant, but give her a son, then I will give him up to the Lord for all the days of his life, and no razor will be ever be used on his head. Then I will give him to the Lord for all the days of his life, and no razor will ever be used on his head. Ito humingi sa Diyos. As you ask something for God, ask in prayer a specific prayer. Nakikilip po ko pa tayo. And the next thing that, that you gotta do is this. Make a vow. Amen? Make a vow. Because Hannah did make a vow. Anong sabi niya? My son will serve the Lord all the days of his life. My son will be used his life for the Lord. Nagigibig ko ako. Ay, di ka ka, lapit ka rito. Muntis ka pa talaga. Di ka, lapit ka. Lapit ka. Come forward. If you are uh, convert pregnant, come forward. And we will pray that God will supply all the needs. All your needs. For the hospital bill and all kinds of bill. And we will ask the Lord that from your womb, God will raise up a mighty man of God. Agree? If John Yun agree, if John Yun agrees, turo mo kami mo sa kanya, John Yun. Kaya ganyan, ganyan na lang. Kung doon agree pa kayo that another man of God will come forth out of the womb of uh, God? Agree? Amen. Padre God, make a divine way, Padre God. Give the necessary amount of money for the hospital bill, for his up for her upcoming Lord, for the uh, for her new uh, for the baby that he, that uh, is about to be born, Padre God. And not only that, Padre God. The baby in her womb, I pray, Padre God, make this baby, Padre God, another man or woman of God. So, Padre God, for your own glory alone, let it go. Let it go. We are praying for the money that will be used for the hospital bill. And not only that, the baby in her womb, will become a mighty man of the world of God. Bawa ka po yung check niya. Ikaw kaya, Pastor Naroan, ito, napit na. Ang bukas ang takbo niya, di. Wala pa naman binibilang na pera, pwede, pwede niya ka nakaagad. Bawa ka po yung mong niya. Father, for your own glory, let it flow. 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 Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Kagaya po ni Hana, na nalangin kami, dinidig mo siya. Dinidig mo kami, Panginoon. I ask you, Pani God, grant the request of Hana of Old Testament. You are now granting our request for Sister Kat and for her baby. Thank you, Father. Lord, bless her, I pray. Remove now all the miseries in her life. 
Mark the way, Lord, na bago matapos ang taong ito before, this year, Padre God, and Padre God, Father, I pray that you will remove all her miseries in Jesus' name. Thank you, Padre God. Grant the good of the best of her heart and may all good and all her good dreams be granted. In Jesus' name, Lord. Amen! God is good. And God is good. All the time. To the darkest night And His light will shine Oh, God is good Oh, ganyan lang, ganyan lang Ganyan lang, ganyan lang, ano, hindi Ganyan lang mga apostolik Tuloy natin Okay na Lagi kayo mag-po dyan Sama ka rito Wala kang boyfriend eh Kaya dito ko gusto kayo walang boyfriend Kahit may boyfriend Ito sa pama Ito ba, buka rin yan Naka madala ng ano, hindi Ituloy natin, next Number four, Hannah was relieved after prayer. Ay, nakahinga siya ng maluwag. Nakahinga ka ng maluwag, Anna? Ah, ha? Di ba nakahinga ka ng maluwag? Pwede ka, 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 ka forward. Come forward. Teka. Oo, oh, batang, ano, batang, batang nervous. Bigyan na, siya nga magbibigyan na, ano, ito, 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 babae, ito, 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 dito, dito tayo, dito tayo. So that uh, our brethren abroad could see us. After prayer, what happened? Can you, you, can, you can say it in English. Honestly, I was relieved. I was... Lakasan, lakasan. I, I was... Kaya? I was relieved. I was blessed by the Lord uh, a while ago. Before, a lot of... A lot of doubts, a lot of problems are in my mind, a lot of worries, but after the man of God have prayed for me, I really felt blessed and really. Amen. Walang pangalang kasi nun. Puno-puno nun siya ng mga doubts, etc. etc. et cetera. Pero patapos siya yung panagamit, na-bless siya. Hana was a believer after prayer. Nakikinig po po pa tayo? Ang matapos yung, alam mo, bigat na bigat yung tip-tip po, matapos yung manalangin, gumagaong na yan eh. Mabigat na gagawin yung tip-tip po, pag pinag-pray ka na rito, gagawin na yan eh. Gagawin na yan. Hannah was relieved after prayer. Per Samuel 1.18. She said, May your servant find favor in your eyes. Then she went her away and ate something and her face was no longer downcast. And her face was no longer downcast. She said, May your servant find favor in your eyes. Then she went her way and ate something and her face was no longer downcast. Nagigilig po ba tayo? Amen po ba? Hindi na siya malungkot, masaya na siya. Hmm? Eh, pag-uwi niyo dyan niyo sa bahay, kahit anong mangyari, at hindi siya sabi siya, tatahimik at siya, kahit anong mangyari. Pag hindi niyo dyan niyo, tinan niyo po siya, pag-uwi niyo ng bahay, hindi siya sabi siya, tahimik po yan. Bahala siya sa buhay, pag-ingay siya na, mangkira siya na, pag-uwi siya na, wala pa kailan niya, kakanta lang yan. That is good. Oo, oh, siya sa... Tingin kayo sa akin, kung bakit ang tao ay nabubugnot sa mga hindi niya, hindi siya sigurado sa kinabukasan niya. If you are not sure about your future, you have no peace. You are always in trouble. Your life is always in trouble. Full of chaos. Full of turmoil. The reason why people are always mad and angry because they are not sure of the future. But if you if you are sure that the Lord is holding your future, wala ka dapat ikatakot. Nothing to be afraid of. Amen po ba? And even I prophesy, before this year ends, before the end of this year,